Well, you know, some of us go all out decorating for Halloween or Christmas, mm -hmm. once or twice a year maybe. What about every day for 13 years? Yeah, this is not just a seasonal decoration uh -uh. here. Danny mm -hmm. New visited a homeowner in Aurora who used his skills as an artist to transform his home into an entire display. And you found wow. this yourself, hard to miss, I guess. Yeah, uh, so my wife and I were going to the post office, the one in Aurora, you know, we're still doing like our thank you letters from the wedding. So we were on the <laughs> okay. post office. It's gonna be a couple trips. Anyway, so we were by Syracuse and Colfax, and I was like, honey, stop the car. What is that? What is this, Steve? This is actually a bed frame. The welder and Whoa. artist, my guy, bed Steve frame. Hartbauer, has transformed his family's home into what he now calls the Enchanted Heart House. And every day he's out here working on his ceramic mosaics, the twisted metal figurines and walkways that you saw before, like the bed frame, and these 31 doors right here that he dedicates mostly to animals because he also volunteers at Dumb mm. Friends League. He really loves mm. animals. So a lot of little animal tiles that he finds and that he puts on there. But how does he do it? What's his technique? Well, Denver 7 actually got that answer four years ago. I glue the tile onto screening that you use for stucco. Check out those old graphics. Remember those things? Yeah. Well, it <laughs> yeah. turns out Micah did a What's That on Steve back in 2019. And like many of us, Steve spent the pandemic getting a lot of work done around the house, but much more pretty projects than ours. Like this is the transformation four years later, figure, finishing wow. his element wall on the south side of the house. And then he also made the garage as beautiful red. And then he also did the back of the house, which is now this like leathery brown. So he's still got to finish a little bit of the sides because Steve says that he's nowhere close to being done. Why aren't you tired of making this giant mosaic? Because um, I have a vision and I have to finish it. I'm hoping to be done in 10 years. I love to spend time by myself, so this gives me an outlet to, to work and, and be by myself. But yeah. Is it relaxing? Sure, it's cathartic. Yeah, absolutely. Smashing stuff and making <laughs> art out of it. That's a metaphor the for life, process. isn't it? You break it down yes. and you glue it back up. He's got 10 years to go. That's right. Yeah. He said he's 10 years left to complete his full vision and he can't stop till he's done. Did you ask That's him amazing. what the neighbors think about it? Uh, <laughs> I will. You know, he said that the neighbors are cool with it, but also that people like ring his doorbell all the time. He's had visitors yeah. from Spain. From Germany, because I see it on like little like wow. lists online of like cool mm -hmm. things to see in Denver, yeah. and then they'll just be like, "Hey, can I come see your house?" And it's like, "Sure, come yeah. on in, come look at my house." Yeah, yeah. It's does like the a museum. inside yeah. look anything like that either? <laughs> he has some really cool projects on the inside. Right. He didn't want me to film them, but like inside and out, he mm -hmm. and his wife are both extremely talented. Wow, yeah. and very detailed. That's good tease. Yeah. He spends yeah. every weekend out there, eight hours a day on the weekend, and when he comes home from work. Wow. Well, I'm glad it's it survived amazing, yeah. our summer weather. Oh, right. Yeah. I know. Hail. Yeah. Like, yeah, I wonder how that holds up some if he's had any damage with the hail. But Ooh. 10 years, are there any blank spaces? Like, where else is it, he going to do work? Looks he's so got, complete. Yeah. He's got one. Yeah, you're right. It does look pretty good, right? He's got, like, one side of the house. He needs to get all the way up to the top. <laughs> And then I'm not sure because I'm not an artist genius. <laughs> yeah. So I, it looked good to me. Name. I was yeah. like, this looks done, right? Yeah. But he's got more to go. Oh, yeah. very cool. Thanks, Dan.